Hey guys, John here with ProH Paintball. Today I'm going to review the HK Army Crash Chest Protector. So I've done some other chest protector reviews and I have to say when I first tried this one on, it's probably the most comfortable out of most of them. It's very, very flexible, very lightweight, um, and it just seems more breathable. So it's got a really nice uh, stretchy material that's like under the arms and on the sides. And it doesn't have like that hardcore mesh. It's got a little bit of mesh just on the back here. Hopefully you can see that behind it at all. Um, it's got really nice flexibility like on the sides here. So everything's very, very flexible. Uh, the foam isn't as thick as let's say the Gen X chest protector. So I think you might feel the shots a little bit more on this one, but I'm not 100% sure and I'm not gonna stand there and get shot. Um, but it's way more flexible, breathable. This is a double X size. They go all the way up to a triple X, I believe, even a four X possibly. And um, I am 5'11", 240. So, I mean, I've got some room in this one. So even if you're probably 6'2", 6'3", 260, you probably could go all the way up to the larger sizes if you needed to. Uh, the smaller ones will fit all the way down to extra small. And so for like the younger kids, it'll fit pretty well, depending on obviously their size. But yeah, so uh, for $59.95, I think you get a really high end, um, breathable, comfortable chest protector. It's gonna protect you all the way in the front here, all the way down the side. So this is obviously what I, the way I like to look at chest protectors and any padding and protection is how am I gonna, when am I gonna get shot? Like how am I gonna be when I'm playing? So like on this one, it doesn't have padding on the side. If my arms are down, it protects me, but most likely I'm gonna be playing with my gun up, something like this. And so right here on your side, it's kind of a tender spot um, and there's no padding here. So, you know, you could wear a hoodie over this or a long sleeve shirt, something like that. Maybe just a cotton t-shirt will help out. But um, if you get shot in the size, it's really thin material. It's not gonna, you know, it's not gonna protect you at all. But as far as facing your opponent, gun up, this protects the foam covers all the way to my arm here, it's all the way around the back of my arm, because I know sometimes the arms hurt a little bit there. Covers, wraps all the way around. But underneath it, um, a very thin, mater breathable material all the way down. So facing your opponent, it's gonna, you know, protect, do everything you need it to. It also has in the center, it has back padding all the way down there. Again, it doesn't cover the sides here, but in the middle, you can see right here, it's probably about a one eighth, one eighth inch material. So compared to like the entry level Gen X one, it's not gonna be as thick. And I would imagine thicker is probably better when it comes to padding and protection, just it's gonna be able to absorb a paintball a lot easier. So I think this will do a great job, I, but I think maybe there might be some other ones out there that have a little bit more protection, but this is a much better quality feeling uh, more comfortable, more breathable. Uh, just, I, I mean, just the feel of it. It almost, obviously I'm wearing something, but if I put a shirt underneath this, I don't think I would be completely uncomfortable um, as far as like feeling like I'm wearing this big foam, you know, bubble wrap type suit, something like that. So you can check it out here. So pretty straightforward. It covers good length on the arm. So if I wanted to wear an arm pad underneath this, most of your arm pads are gonna go up underneath this here. And so it's gonna offer continued protection all the way down both arms. Again, right here. Sometimes I don't like getting shot in the bottom of the arm. Usually when you're like come out to play and you get shot, sometimes you get shot in the bottom and you can kind of feel it. Um, so that might, you know, might you still might, still might get that. But for general protection, for a good quality, very breathable, you don't want something too big and bulky. Like let's say you live in Florida or Texas and you want something that's not gonna be crazy hot. This thing is really comfortable. Like, I don't really feel like I'm sweating at all. Um, I feel like as I'm moving, I can actually feel like air moving throughout the chest protector. And again, this is a double X, uh, so I have some room to move around in it. So I really like it, it's pretty good. Uh, we haven't had any of these returned. Usually that's kind of how we judge if a product is good or not. If we sell a good amount of them, we have customers that complain or we have to call HK and say, hey, look, the stitching's coming out of it or this customer tore it up. Um, Usually, you know, we're like, yeah, we usually don't recommend that product, but we haven't had that issue with these at all. And it's a very popular chest protector. Um, I do recommend though, if you're going to wear it to wear like a long sleeve shirt over it, even if it's a thin shirt, because if you tear this material here, um, you may, you know, tear up the foam permanently and it just could just get worse. So, you know, I would imagine that you probably much prefer to tear like a $20 cotton t-shirt uh, compared to a $60 chest protector. So I definitely recommend like a, a long sleeve dry fit usually works pretty good. So you still get some air, but also protects this from like any tree branches or something like that. So other than that, yeah, it's um, like I said, real stretching material across the bottom. Looks like some good stitching, just very flexible. I like it a lot. So you can see the back a little bit better. Good to go. Uh, the arms are here aren't real tight, so they're just sewn pretty loose. So like I know some people don't like feeling restricted, like some of the arm pads. Um, but it's not really that. That's not really the issue here. So, so yeah. But this just chest.
This chest protector is available on our website right now, prohpb.com. Just type in chest protector at the top. All of our options will pull up. We do have multiple brands that you can uh, check out and shop around with different prices and whatnot. Um, also, we carry arm pads, knee pads, slide shorts, all that good stuff. So, yeah, you're looking for padding and protection, check out our website, prohpb.com, live right now. Yeah, you have any questions, comment below. Otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, guys.